Hello. In today's video, we are going to look at how to configure Health Monitor Plus. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is look at adding an IP server to the system. Uh, so we will come up to the top and click on IP server. Uh, and from here, uh, you have a couple of different choices. Left hand side, you can update an IP server, enroll an IP server, bulk import, or group management. So we are going to take and enroll an IP server. Uh, brings up this panel. Uh, so we'll enter a name for the server. So we'll just call this lab server. Uh, put in the IP address of that server. Also the serial number. Uh, user we'll look at later. Uh, once we've got the server in, we will take and look at creating some users and then assigning those users to the system. Uh, minutes to warning, minutes to error. Uh, minutes to warning is going to be when the system takes and says, okay, that a uh, camera has been down for 15 minutes, let's send out an email saying that there's a possible problem. Um, and then if, if after 20 more minutes and it's going to say, okay, clearly there's a problem, uh, let's take and notify people. Um, below that, we have our groups. Uh, we can create groups. We'll look at doing that uh, once we get the server brought in. And you can also fill in the rest of the information down towards the bottom. Right hand side are notification types. Uh, these different notification types are going to be are going to drive what the minutes to warning and minutes to error are going to produce. Uh, so I will go ahead and just choose all of these. And then I'll hit save. Okay, get a message saying that the details have saved successfully. And now if I go home. I can see I have one server that's down um, as I'm waiting for that server. Uh, next, we're going to take and look at uh, BI Monitor Plus and how to take and set the server to communicate back to this system. And then from here or from there, we'll take and go back into the system when, once it's connected back up uh, and be able to look and see what we can do with that server once it's there. Next, we're going to look at how to uh, have the IP server report to the Health Monitor Plus server. Uh, so you're going to log in using an admin account. We're going to go to Administration, Servers, Server Setup. Inside of Server Setup, we'll click on the server that we're interested in working with. We'll go to Advanced. And then down at the bottom right hand corner where it's Health Monitor, you're going to go ahead and check that box. Uh, I've already have this server set up to report to my Health Monitor Plus server. Uh, so you're going to put in the IP address uh, and then help VI Health Monitor Proxy. Um, you can also click this set to default URL and then you can update the information as well. Uh, once you're done, click the save button. Once it finishes saving, you can go ahead and close and log out. 